Hi, this is Tyler with Audentio here to discuss the UEX Node Layout Manager system. Now, some of you may be familiar with the side-by-side -side node layouts that UEX has had in the past, but now we've extended that amount of layout control by at least an order of magnitude. If I take a look at my node tree here, you can see we've added options not only for global layout options, but we've also added the ability to customize layouts on an individual category basis. Now if we take a look at our default layout options, you'll notice we have a multitude of options available to us. Here we have the maximum amount of columns displayed per node. Here we have the minimum column width of each of those nodes inside the category. And this third option here is, gives you a couple of options as to how the last nodes flex to fill the container. Looking at our demo category, you can see we have five columns here. As we shrink the browser down, the nodes break underneath um, intelligently, uh, flexing to fill the space of the container. And as you can see, by changing the fill last row option, we can drastically change the behavior by which these nodes wrap. For completely custom layouts, you can choose to set the column widths to a custom width on a per column basis. Uh, this works similar in the fashion of bootstrapped to where if you wanted a column three times the size of two other columns you'd enter a grid value of three, one, and one. Now to get a layout like this you might want to set your minimum column width down to some place around 150 pixels.